So it is near the end of the month. I am completely done, or almost near done. I finished the arbor already uh, with Operation Siren. So in this video, we'll be covering over the recent update we got, re um, I think like a month ago, about the OS shop and what you guys should do to prioritize all that junk. So the nice thing is you can see all of the tabs available here, which is very, very convenient, very, very nice. Uh, I think aside from like one thing, like these things right here, I bought out the entire shop or waited uh, before I bought out the entire shop. So we don't do any of that jazz. So in this video, we'll talk about priorities and what to buy and all that junk. So let's get right into it. So if you're in, um, if you guys have been saving up or not spending it too much, uh, we'll go through each tab because there's a weird way of doing this kind of video style. We'll go through each tab and wait you grab for it. So in New York City, assuming you guys are like pretty deep into OS, uh, you guys can clear all the way up to the 35 captured areas. I would buy out all these coordinates right here. You guys can get some gold plates from these things. It is very, very nice. Cap all these out. It's very good. Now, when we get to the lower tier, so once again, buy all these things. If you do two and three, it's debatable if you guys really want to do these. These don't really give you high odds of gold plates, but there's still that off chance that you could get a gold plate here. So personally, I just grabbed them. I know it's annoying, but I still grab tier threes, uh, even though it's like very, very abysmal race in tier twos. Uh, but if you guys want to skip these, those, it's not a big deal. You definitely, definitely skip those. Now, if you guys need some more tuning uh, special samples, go ahead and do so. Uh, I will tell you guys that... Um, I will tell you guys that uh, I haven't picked up any of the ones aside from like maybe a costume shop once or twice and I filled out my adaptability perfectly without needing any of that stuff. So you don't have to, but if you guys are going to uh, need to push earlier maps for like more, if you need more adaptability to push the higher tier maps, then go ahead and grab the training samples as well too. I'll grab these because these are very, very good for exchange rates at the end of the month for more of those uh, white ticket currencies or whatever. Uh, but you can leave the rest of the tuning samples if you don't need them anymore. Again, all you need for OS is 205, 205, and I think like 188. So anything more than that is just extra. You don't need more than that at all. So going back to the second tab right here, we have Liverpool. In this one, uh, again... If you guys are grinding a lot, definitely buy out the action points. It is very, very worth it. So grab all these things. After that, grab the purple tokens right here. There's a lot of them. So free tokens, which will be helpful for your buying stuff. And grab at least the tier threes. Uh, tier twos and tier ones, you don't have to. Uh, but tier threes, though, you're going to need a lot, especially circuit boards. You're going to need a lot of these. So I highly recommend picking these up. Because, wow, I rolled one circuit board here. Unreal. Uh, so, but I would definitely do that. You can leave the other ones, though. You don't have to pick them up. Uh, I'm probably going to skip on these or pick them up because I don't know I'm doing my special tokens. Might as well just collect them, honestly. But you don't have to pick these up. I will leave them because you'll get a lot from just farming normal maps. Now, when we get to Gibraltar, this one, honestly, you could probably skip. Um, a lot of these mats or whatever you can get passively from just like meta fights and stuff but if you guys really really want to just pick up like a light amount of these you don't need too too many of them i'm probably just gonna grab this for collection because i have so many points at this um at this rate so i'm gonna do that uh more meta skill books so i can skip the grind definitely definitely you gonna do that oh purple ones as well too that's also very nice but again you don't have to pick this one it's very very optional if you guys want to max out meta ship though definitely do this now the best tab saint petersburg Assuming you guys have cleared out all, every single one of these things, definitely pick up the ordnance because these are very, very rare. After that, grab these right here. So the UR design prints and then the gold plates. You're going to need a lot of gold plates. Big, big focus on these things. So buy them out whenever you see them. Hopefully you get aircrafts and uh, main gun plates. Very, very nice here. I think that's all of them. Now, after this, uh, it's up to you guys what you want to do. If you guys want to grab more uh, prototypes or whatever to make some plus 13s, go ahead and do so. SR gear prints are nice as well, too. And these are very, very rare as well. You can turn these into tier 3s. So I'll probably put this actually next tier because these are very, very rare. You guys are going to need a lot of these because you can turn these tier 3 2s into tier 3s. So do that. And then the rest, if you guys want them, go ahead and pick them up. 
Uh, I might as well just grab all these, but you, again, you guys don't have to. If you guys don't have the special tokens for it, just go ahead and skip that. So that's all I'm going to do for this video. A very quick guide and rundown on what you should focus on with the shops. Again, um, in order to access the better shops, you're going to have to grind and p clear more areas. If you guys can clear 50, that's great. If you guys can't, though, just work with what you have and just pick up the priorities and be good to go. All right. Thank you guys for watching as always. Any questions, feel free to comment and I'll answer them if I see the chance. And I'll see you guys in the next video.